Hey guys, this is Naman sharing about WordPress and in today's video, I am going to share how we can create a download file button in Elementor without using any additional plugin or writing any code. So you can simply enable your visitors to download an asset from your website. So without further ado, let's start this video. After logging into WordPress dashboard, we will simply open that page, post or template in Elementor in whichever we want to add that download button. So in my case, I want to add that download button in my home page. So I will open it with the Elementor. After that, we will open the settings for that specific button. My button is already designed uh, because in this video, I'm not going to show how we can create a button or design a button. I'm expecting that you already know this and my straightforward focus is creating a download functionality in button. So we will just simply click on button and go to the left toolbar and first of all we will paste the link of that specific asset in the link field for that we will open the media library of our website and here it is and upload that specific file into our media library in my case i already have a pdf uploaded in the media library so after uploading that asset into the media library you will simply copy the URL of that asset by clicking on this button copy URL to clipboard and just go back to the editor and paste that link after that we will click on this link option and write an attribute which is download and just simply click on update now if we preview our website and click on this download button we can see now our download button is working and we successfully download the PDF from this button. In the same way, if you want to connect any image with that download button, you will simply go to the media library, select that image and copy the URL of that image and again go back to the editor and paste the link and click on update. And now if we preview our website, we will simply click on download and as we can see the image is downloaded and in the same way if we want our visitors to download multiple files from the same button then first we will need to compress or make a zip file for all those assets and then we will simply upload that zip file into our media library like I already have a zip file in my media library I will simply copy the URL of that asset and again paste the URL in the link field and click on update and now if I preview my website and just simply click on download now we can see the zip file is downloaded so in the same way whatever asset you want your user to download from your website you will simply connect that that asset URL in the link field of button I hope this video will help you in creating a download button for your website and if you want to see such more videos on Elementor or WordPress, feel free to let me know in the comment box. And if you like the video, like and subscribe.